Hello, welcome to how to solve this factorial equation n factorial plus n is equal to n cube and we need to find the value of n. First of all we move this plus n to the right side n factorial is equal to n cubed and this positive n becomes negative n. Now because 3 factorial is equal to 3 times 2 factorial that is equal to 3 times this 2 is 3 minus 1 factorial it means 3 factorial is equal to 3 times 3 minus 1 factorial so this n factorial n factorial is equal to n times n minus 1 factorial. So, we replace this n factorial with this n times n minus 1 factorial n times n minus 1 factorial is equal to and from n cube minus n we can take n as common n as common times in bracket left n square minus 1 next we divide both sides of this equation by n this n will be cancelled with this n and this n will be cancelled with this n and here left n minus 1 factorial is equal to n square minus 1. Now, according to this rule, this n minus 1 factorial n minus 1 factorial is equal to n minus 1 times n minus 2 factorial. So, we replace this n minus 1 factorial with this n minus 1 times n minus 2 factorial n minus 1 times n minus 2 factorial is equal to now we can consider this one as 1 square because 1 square is equal to 1 and according to algebraic identity a square minus b square is equal to a plus b times a minus b we can write this n square minus 1 square as n plus 1 times n minus 1 now we divide both sides by n minus 1 this n minus 1 will be cancelled with this n minus 1 and this n minus 1 will be cancelled with this n minus 1 and here left n minus 2 factorial is equal to n plus 1 next we suppose that this n minus 2 is equal to r let n minus 2 is equal to r and this implies n is equal to we move this negative 2 to the right side r plus 2 and we substitute a value of n minus 2 r and value of n r plus 2 in this equation then this equation becomes r factorial is equal to the value of n is r plus 2 plus this one next r factorial is equal to r 2 plus 1 plus 3 now if we put the value of r 0 in this equation if r is equal to 0 and we put 0 in place of r in this equation then 0 factorial is equal to 
the value of r 0 plus 3 0 factorial is equal to 1 is equal to 0 plus 3 3 and 1 is not equal to 3. Now, if r is equal to 1 and we put the value of r 1 in this equation 1 factorial is equal to the value of r 1 plus 3 1 factorial is equal to 1 is equal to and 1 plus 3 is 4 and 1 is not equal to 4. Now, if, if value of r is equal to 2 and we put value of r 2 in this equation then 2 factorial is equal to the value of r 2 plus 3 2 factorial is equal to 2 is equal to 2 plus 3 5 and 2 is not equal to 5. And if we put the value of r value of r 3 in this equation then 3 factorial is equal to the value of r 3 plus 3. 3 factorial is equal to 6 is equal to 3 plus 3 6. You can see that the left hand side is equal to the right hand side. Value of r is 3. Now, to find the value of n we put the value of r 3 in this equation n is equal to the value of r is 3 plus 2 n is equal to 3 plus 2 5. So, this is the value of n. Now, to verify that this value of n is correct or not we put this value of n 5 in the original equation. The original equation is n factorial plus n is equal to n cubed. In this equation, we put the value of n 5. 5 factorial plus 5 is equal to 5 cube. 5 factorial is equal to 120 plus 5 is equal to 5 cube is equal to 125 and 120 plus 5 125 is equal to 125. You can see that left hand side is equal to the right hand side. So, it is proved that the value of n 5 is correct.